Um, we have McNeese State, and we have head coach Brooks Donald Williams, Jalen Johnson, Natanya Jones, and Allison Baggett. And we'll start off with a statement from Coach Williams. Yeah, I mean, first of all, hats off to Corpus Christi. I thought they, sorry for my voice, by the way. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> That's what happens when we have all these intense games. But anyway, hats off to Royce Chadwick and, uh, and his staff and his team. I mean, they did a tremendous job all year. and. Uh, we have a lot of respect for them. We have a lot of respect for their players. Jasmine Shaw is an incredible young lady, really tough kid to guard. And uh, this was a really tough challenge for us. So we're, uh, we're really proud of our girls and proud of our fight. I said in the locker room just now, I mean, this is one of the few games this year that we had a deficit in the second half and really fought back and, and overcame some, some struggles defensively. And, just to see that toughness at tournament time is so important, and I'm really proud of them. If anybody heard that, that was great. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Questions? Brooks, Alex Hickey, Lake Charles American Press. Uh, talk about defending all the time. It's maybe the only thing you ever talk about. Uh, <laughs> to see the final two minutes, the, sort of the shutdown defense, you had uh, Amber made a play. Allison made a deflection. Just how much was that the key to this win? I mean, it was the key to the win, you know, other than you wearing your fedora. We always win when you wear that hat. <laughs> <laughs> it's a good luck to in football and basketball at McNeese. So keep it on, Alex. But no, you know, I mean, on a serious note, I mean, that's that was the, the key to the game. We got stops when it mattered. Uh, you know, I felt like we we really made some good adjustments. I thought the kids made mistakes but still toughed it out. And uh, those last few plays that you're talking about, I mean, Al was beat and she made a big play. I mean, they, they made big time plays in crutch situations. And that was definitely the biggest key to the game is our defensive effort and our toughness at the end. Could you uh, address, you know, uh, Amber making that shot and, you know, the, the block at the other end, five minutes in crunch time, you know, just for a role player to step up, just uh, how big was that? You know, that's Amber Donez's game. I mean, it's it's real. It's, it's just crazy basketball, and it's a lot of fun to play with her. I mean, I'm speaking for them. Yes, but she made a big time play, and how about that shot? I mean, she, you know, I mean, it surprised us all that she a took it and b it went in. But that's the way Amber plays. She's an up tempo, energy kid, and uh, that's what she does really well for the cowgirls. Natani, you certainly didn't look like you were uh, ready to give up your career yet. Just, you know, what was the, the emotion like for you going into this game that was as intense as I've seen you play? Emotion, it was crazy, but it was very intense. I believed in my team. My team believed in me because the last few games I haven't been myself. I wasn't playing like myself. And my team, they still believed in me. They still fought for me. My coaches still believed in me. They still fought for me and for everybody to fight together because I wasn't ready to go home yet. Wasn't nobody ready to go home. So we here for another game. Brooks, how important Natanya making those shots when they were trying to do the trap and throw you off offensively, that kind of got them out of that. Was that the, the key to it's coming a huge back? Key. I mean, those are shots we didn't finish at their place, oh, you know, a week ago. And, and uh, those are shots that Natanya can certainly make. Uh, we count on her to make those, and uh, she did it tonight on a big stage, and we knew she would. Allison, uh, I figure somebody would want to ask, but just talk about, you know, this is the first time you're having the chance to, to be in a, a starring role kind of in this tournament. Just how exciting is that for you? Um, I mean, it's great, but uh, when it comes down to it, we all play you know, as one, and uh, I mean, we we did so good tonight doing that. I mean, we all played together, yeah. we fought together, we came back together, and uh, I mean, that was why we won. So it was big. Brandon Williams, Southland.org. Allison, uh, talk about you know the deflection uh, in the closing seconds when it looked like they had an opportunity to tie it. Uh. <laughs> Honestly, I got burned pretty bad <laughs> on the screens, and uh, I saw her go out there, so I took off, and then I knew she was about to shoot it, so I was like, well, let me just go for it. <laughs> and luckily, I got a tip on it. And 
Uh, well, this goes for anybody, but mostly Brooks. Uh, UCA tomorrow. It's you know been a good matchup over the past several years. Does that just kind of feel right that this is what will uh, come down to the season advancing? There's no question. We have we've had a big rivalry uh, with you know with players that are gone and players that are still here, and uh, we're looking forward to having a rematch with them. And they really challenged us at our place, and uh, we're going to certainly study that and be ready to go tomorrow. But, yeah, I mean, there's no question. It's very fitting for us to be competing against such Arkansas with our history. Jalen, you want to add to that? You look like an actress. <laughs> <laughs> we're just basically ready to redeem myself. They, they played hard when we played them the first time, and we just got to do better in this game. <clears throat> Yeah. Uh, John Goodman, KEZM Radio, Lake Charles, Louisiana. Um, Coach Williams, uh, number five, Campanero, had space early in the game, and she was making shots, and then, you know, she had a lot of assists. And then it seemed like as the game went on, you tightened up, uh, tightened up the defense on, on number five, and Jalen did a great job sticking with her in the second half, and they didn't seem as effective. Did you discuss with the team that, you know, we needed to clamp down on her a little bit? I think, John, I think you're, you're exactly right. She really hurt us early, I mean, throughout the, the course of the game. And, and we didn't do a very good job slowing her down and, and limiting her, you know, her setups for everybody else. And uh, what, a, what a great job she did throughout the course of the season. But certainly in this game, Jalen did a fantastic job just keeping her in front and slowing her down and gave her a little bit of trouble. And I think that really helped us turn the corner, too. Uh, that was a big key. You know, she didn't get the drives that she got early, and she didn't have the freedom to make the plays and create for her teammates like she did early. And Jalen did a great job shutting her down a little bit. Any other questions? Thank you. Thank you.